हेलो फ्रेंड्स आज हम लोग बात करेंगे वेव पावर के बारे में और उसको समझेंगे दिस इज़ द डायग्राम हाउ टू यूज वेव पावर वेव एनर्जी कन्वर्टर है ऑन दिस साइड यूरोपियन मरीन एनर्जी सेंटर सी ई एम एम सी ई एम ई सी इन टू थाउजेंड एट हजोरा एट द यू एस नेवी वेव एनर्जी टेस्ट साइट एंड द एम एच वी कन्वर्टर इन बोमोरा वेव पावर दिस इज द वन टर्वाइन जनरेटर वेव पावर स्टेशन यूजिंग अ पेनुमा पेनोमेटिक चैम्बर तो दोस्तों वेव पावर इज द कैप्चर ऑफ एनर्जी ऑफ विंड विंड वेव डू यूजफुल वर्क फॉर एग्जाम्पल इलेक्ट्रिसिटी जनरेशन वाटर डिसलेशन और पम्पिंग वाटर अ मशीन दैट एक्सपोज एक्सप्लॉइट्स वेव पावर इज अ वेव एनर्जी कन्वर्टर द वेव पावर इज अ डिस्टिंक्ट फ्रॉम टाइडल पावर विच कैप्चर्ड द एनर्जी ऑफ द करेंट कॉज बाय द ग्रेविटेशनल पुल of the sun and moon waves and tides are also distinct from the ocean currents which are caused by the other force including break, breaking waves winds cols effect cabbing and difference in the temperature and salinity wave power generation is not a widely employed commercial technology compared to other stabilized renewable energy source such as wind power hydro power solar power however there is have been attempts to use this source of energy since at least 1990 1890 mainly due to its high power density as comparison the power density of the photovoltaic panel is 1 km 1 kw per meter square at a peak solar insulation and the power density of wind is 1 kw per meter square at 12 m per second whereas the average annual power density of the waves at sg san francisco cost is 25 kw per meter square physical concept ki agar iski baat karte hain to aap dekh sakte ho this is a floating object and this is a path is electrically trajectory path these are the ripples and wave propagation kis tarah se ye ho raha hai aur second when object poops up and down and ripple in a bound it follows approximately elliptical trajectory this is the diagram motions wave motions of particle in the ocean wave a at the deep water b is the shallow water and first the propagation direction second is the wave crest and third is the wave trough this is the water level under said photograph of the elliptical trajectory of water particles under a progressive and periodic surface gravity wave in a wave flume the wave conditions are mean water depth waves are generated by wind passing over the surface of the sea wave height determined by the wind speed and the duration of time the wind has been blowing fact sea floor a given wind speed has a matching practical limit over which time or distance will not produce larger waves when it is limit has been reached the sea is said to be fully developed in general larger waves are more careful but wave power is also determined by wave speed wavelength and water density oscillating motion is the highest at the surface and depends exponentially with the depth however for standing waves near of reflecting coast wave energy is also present as pressure oscillating at the great depth producing micro seism these pressure fluctuation at greater depth are too small be interesting from the point of view of wave power wave propagate of the ocean surface and the wave energy is also transported horizontally with the group velocity the mean transport rate of the wave energy through a vertical plane of unit width parallel to wave crest is called the wave energy flux not be confused with the actual power generated by a wave power devices this is the wave formula P is equal to rho g square upon sixty four pi h square m naught t e. 
दैट इज़ जीरो पॉइंट फाइव किलो वॉल्ट मीटर क्यूब सेकेंड एच स्क्वायर एम नॉट टी ई विद द पी इज द वेव एनर्जी फ्लक्स पर यूनिट ऑफ द वेव प्लस लेंथ एच एम नॉट इज द सिग्निफिकेंट वेव हाइट एंड टी इज द वेव एनर्जी पीरियड रो इज द डेंसिटी वाटर डेंसिटी एंड जी इज द एक्सलेशन टू बाई ग्रेविटी द एव फॉर्मूला स्टेट दैट द वेव पावर इज अ प्रपोर्शनल टू द वेव एनर्जी पीरियड एंड द स्क्वायर ऑफ द वेव हाइट वैन द सिग्निफिकेंट वेव हाइट इज गिवन इन मीटर एंड द वेव पीरियड इन सेकेंड द रिजल्ट द वेव पावर इन किलो वॉट पर मीटर ऑफ वेव फ्रंट लेंथ दिस इज द वेव एनर्जी एंड वेव एनर्जी फ्लक्स इन अ सी स्टेट द एवरेज एनर्जी डेंसिटी पर यूनिट एरिया ऑफ ग्रेविटी वेव्स ऑन द वाटर सरफेस इज प्रपोर्शनल टू द वेव हाइट स्क्वायर्ड अकॉर्डिंग टू द लीनियर वेव थ्योरी ई इज कल टू वन बाई सिक्सटीन रो जी एच स्क्वायर एम नॉट वेर ई इज द मेन वेव एनर्जी डेंसिटी पर यूनिट हॉर्जेंटल एरिया कॉमा द सम ऑफ काइनेटिक एंड पोटेशन एनर्जी डेंसिटी पर यूनिट हॉर्जेंटल एरिया द पोटेशन एनर्जी डेंसिटी इज इक्वल टू द काइनेटिक एनर्जी एंड बोथ कॉन्ट्रीब्यूटिंग हाफ ऑफ द हाफ टू द वेव एनर्जी डेंसिटी ई कैन बी एक्सपेक्टेड फ्रॉम द इक्वी पार्शिएटेशन थ्योरम इन ओशन वेव सरफेस टेंशन इफेक्ट्स आर निगलिजिबल फॉर द वेव लेंथ फॉर अ फ्यू डेसी मीटर दिस इज द फेस विलोसिटी दिस इज द ग्रुप विलोसिटी दिस इज द रेशियो सी जी अपॉन सी पी वेव लेंथ जनरल वेव एनर्जी डेंसिटी वेव एनर्जी फ्लक्स एंग्लो फ्रिक्वेंसी वेव नंबर डीप वाटर कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स एंड इज ऑब्सिटी द डीप वाटर करेस्पॉन्डिंग्स विद द वाटर डेप्थ लार्जर दैन हाफ ऑफ द वेव लेंथ विच इज द कम विच इज द कॉमन सिचुएशन इन द सी एंड द ओशन इन डीप वाटर लॉन्गर पीरियड वेव प्रोपोगेट्स फास्टर एंड ट्रांसपोर्ट देयर एनर्जी फास्टर द डीप वाटर ग्रुप विलोसिटी इज हाफ द फेस विलोसिटी इन शैलो वाटर द वेव लेंथ लार्जर दैन अबाउट ट्वेंटी टाइम्स द वाटर डेप्थ एज फाउंड क्वाइट ऑफन near the coast the group velocity is equal to the phase velocity modern technology ki baat kare to wave power device aap dekh sakte ho yahan par ki wave power devices are generally categorized by the method of used to capture or harness energy of the wave by location and by the power take off location are shore line near shore and offshore types of power take off include hydraulic ram elastomeric hose hose pump pump to shore hydroelectric turbine and air turbine and linear electrical generator when evaluating wave energy as a technology type it is important to distinguish between the four most common approaches point observer bios surface attenuators oscillating water columns and overtopping devices in this diagram generic wave energy concept point absorber attenuator oscillating wave fuse converter oscillating water column overtopping device and submerged pressure differentiational this is a point absorber point absorber boy this device floats on the surface of water held in the place of cables connected to the sea bed the point absorber is defined as having a device with width much smaller than the incoming wavelength a good point absorber has the same characteristics as a good wave maker the wave energy a good point absorber has the same characteristics as a good wave maker the wavelength The wave energy is absorbed by radiating a wave with destructive interference to the incoming waves. Boas use the rise and fall swells to generate electricity in the various phase including directly via linear generator or via generator driven by the mechanical linear to rotatory converter or hydraulic pumps. Electromagnetic field generated by electrical transmission cables and acoustics of these devices may be concerned for marine organism. the presence of the boas may affects fish marine mammals and birds as potential minor 
collision risk and roosting sites. Potential also exists the entanglement in the monitoring lines. Energy removed from the waves may also affect the shore lines, resulting in a recommendation that sites remain a considerable distance from shore. Surface attenuator. This device acts similarly to the point observer buoys with multiple floating segments connected to the one another are oriented perpendicular to the incoming waves. Jo bhi flexible flex, flexing move, motion is created by the swells and that motion drives hydraulic pumps to generate electricity. Environmental effects are similar to those of point absorber buoys and additional concern the organism could be pinched in the joint. Oscillating wave surge converter these devices typically have one fixed to a structure or the seabed while the other end is free to move energy is collected from the relative motion of the body compared to the fixed point oscillating water column device can be located on shore or in deeper water offshore with an air chamber integrated into the device swells compress air in the chambers forcing air through the an air turbine to create electricity over topping device over tubing device are long structures that use wave velocity to fill reservoir to greater water level than surrounding ocean submerged pressure differentiation submerged pressure differentiation based converters are comparatively newer technology utilizing flexible membranes to extract wave energy these converters use the difference in pressure at different location below the wave produce a pressure difference within the closed power takeoff fluid system this is the environmental effect the risk of marine mammals and fish being struck by the tidal turbine blades the effect of electromagnetic fields the physical presence of marine uh, energy the potential effect of near field far field marine environmental and process such as the sedimental transport and water quality thanks for watching and sharing